whenever you see today's service. If there's anything that we can do as a church, church leadership, to help encourage more attendance on Sunday mornings, please let us know. If, you, if you're here and there's something you think that would work, or if, if you're at home and you think there's something that would work, please let us know. Let us, let us figure out ways to try to encourage more of our brothers and sisters to attend on Sunday morning. Having said that, we do have a um, nursery here in the building. I don't think I see any little ones really this morning, but we do have a nursery. It's not, it's not attended, but you can go use it. Uh, attendance cards and blue cards on the seat backs in front of you, please fill those out. The um, collection plates are at the back since we're not passing those around right now during communion time. So please drop your, if you're visiting, drop your attendance card in. If you um, uh, have a prayer request or a prayer praise, please drop that too. Um, Hope Medical Clinic in information on the back too. I don't think there's anything else that I need to bring up. Um, so at this time, we'll have our opening scripture and prayer. Let's pray. Father, we're here today, Father God, to to praise you, Father God. And we thank you. We thank you for loving us. Father, you're the, you're the Lord of heaven. You're the Lord of earth. Father, you're the Lord of all creation. God, as we look at the perfection of your universe, it just shows your glory, Father. And we thank you for that, dear God. We thank you for loving us. We thank you for your son, Father, oh, that was willing to come for us and die for us. As your scripture says, as we were still sinners, we thank you for that, Father. Dear Lord, I want to raise a few people specifically to you this morning, Father, that were on our prayer list. I want you to touch these people, Father. I pray for Jan. I pray for Dub. I pray for Robert, dear Lord, as his PT starts this week. I, I pray for my Oklahoma friend, Jim Rogers, Father. I pray for his wife. Touch these people, Father God, with your healing that they need, Father God, that only you can provide. We thank you, Father, that we can petition you for all our needs. But today, specifically, Father God, we come to you to praise you and to worship you. Thank you, Lord. And it's in the name of Jesus Christ I pray this. Amen. I'm going to read uh, the 80th Psalm today. Gary asked that I do it in original Hebrew. <laughs> but I told him, you know, I'd be glad to do that, but then everybody would start thinking I was as smart as him. So <laughs> I, I wasn't going to do that. But, but anyway, uh, let's read. Hear us, shepherd of Israel, you who led Joseph like a flock, you who sit enthroned between the cherubim, shine forth before Ephraim, Benjamin, and Manasseh. Awaken your might, come and save us. Restore us, O God. Make your face shine on us that we may be saved. How long, Lord God Almighty, will your anger smolder against the prayers of your people? You have fed them with the bread of tears. You have made them drink tears by the bowl full. You have made us an object of derision to our neighbors and to our, and our enemies mock us. Restore us, God Almighty. Make your face shine on us that we may be saved. You transplanted a vine from Egypt. You drove out the nations and planted it. You cleared the ground for it, and it took root and filled the land. The mountains were covered with its shade, the mighty cedars with its branches. Its branches reached as far as the sea, it shoots as far as the river. Why have you broken down its walls so that all who pass by pick its grapes? Boars from the forest ravage it, and insects from the fields feed on it. Return to us, God Almighty. Look down from heaven and see. Watch over this vine, the root 
your right hand has planted, the sun you have raised up for yourself. Your vine is cut down, it is burned with fire, at your rebuke your people perish. Let your hands rest on the man at your right hand, the son of man you have raised up for yourself. Then we will not turn away from you. Revive us, and we will call on your name. Restore us, Lord God Almighty. Make your face shine on us that we may be saved. Thank you, brother. Before we stand up and greet everybody and have a few seconds of uh, sweet fellowship, I want to remind everybody the the bracelets. So if you're wearing a bracelet, green, give some hugs. If you're wearing yellow, fist bumps and maybe a little talking in red, just kind of keep your distance a little bit. People are a little still a little, a little concerned. But if everybody will please stand up. We're going to turn around and we're going to look at the back and we're going to wave to everybody in Facebook land and say hi to everybody and greet everybody.